Yeah, hey, what's up, you guys? This is Gasson. We're coming back, and my clan has been asking me if I can get this clan war they did because I guess it was pretty close. Let me see where it is. Hold on. They had a really close war, and it was really clutch. So let's check it out. Oh, okay, yeah. So they won by one, one star. It looks like. Whoa. So let me go ahead and check it out and see what they did. Dang. What well, did it look like? Anybody's getting top dog? Let's just try and see if we can find the uh, two stars and we'll uh, show off those. Well, I wish I could show you guys the replays, but the um, the replays are gone. I, I believe it's because after every maintenance break we have, they just get rid of the replays. But at least I'm going to give a shout out to you guys for uh, doing a good job on the clan war. So good stuff. And this is the clan right here, Battlegate. Someone actually asked me on uh, one of my recent videos if I should, or if I can, go back down to a gold league or something or crystal so I could do farming videos again. So I don't know. I'm, I'm actually thinking about it. I do have a second account waiting, and maybe I could use that to do some lower level gameplay. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that in the comment box. Or if you just want me to stick to high level gameplay, I could do that. Let's see what kind of replays we got. All right, and we got to, uh, I don't even know how to say his name, Knight from Gigs Rock. And it looks like he's gonna do some big things with uh, Go Wipe. He has three Pekkas on deck, and his heroes are actually going in right away. So he's deployed the Rage Spell. The Infernal Tower is locked onto all of the uh, troops, so hopefully he has a free spell he could throw on there. Now the P.E.K.K.A.s are trapped it looks like they're not going to go shopping this time. They're going to make their way to the center. Hopefully. And the Queen is just tag teaming with them. Lots of money to be made. And the Wizards are doing all the work. Whoa, I've never seen that. Wizards want the Town Hall. That's why those troops are so deadly. They, they are forced to be reckoned with. They'll do the job by themselves. <laughs> what the heck was the king doing? There's nothing in there. All right, so he's got the two star and he only has a queen left. The infernal tower has been taken out. Oh man, he wants that money. So that's the thing with me, whenever I attack, I just throw all my troops in. Some people are good at preserving some of them so that they can uh, clean up and get that 50%. Whoa, the minions did just the amount of work to take out that Tesla. And this wizard is going to one-shot everything. Oh, man. Oh, beat you to it. <laughs> And this looks like it could actually be a possible three star. As long as these minions can do the job without getting hit by a uh, balloon. Okay, looks like it's good. There's no hope. And Golem's trapped. <laughs> All right. So that's in the bag. Three star, good stuff. Alright you guys, so this is going to be our last raid of the day and this one is by Baba Barnett from King's Throne. It looks like he's doing the Holy Warrior technique. This is actually where you have a bunch of healers on your heroes. Uh, now, I'm not sure if it works too well because the heroes got such a decrease in their hit points and their health, etc. But uh, let's see if Baba Barnett can pull it off. I'm pretty sure the king, if he gets with the healers on him, he'll do a pretty good job. And looks like the healers are actually switching targets over to the king and the Pekkas, which is very good. These guys should be able to hold their own for a little bit. Now, as long as he can clear out those troops, uh, clan castle troops, then he should be fine because the wizards do such big damage on heroes. But looks like he threw a, a free spell on it and cleared them out pretty good. Now the only thing he needs to worry about now is just the other Archer Queen that's staring at him over there. If she locks on then she can do pretty good damage against the King as well. But let's see if he can run over there and take her out before she gets the chance. 
Okay, so the infernal towers are actually locked on and you can't the healers won't really have any effect Once the infernal towers lock on like that. They just burn right through the hills But the Queen is actually in position to take out that town hall I'm not sure if he already used his ability, but he might not need it because he already got it And it looks like the Pekkas are just going around cleaning up. They cleaning the house cleaning town Taking the rest of this stuff. I wouldn't be surprised if this is actually a three-star. He's got enough Pekkas to do it with the healer on him. The thing is, they're just so slow. They hit pretty hard, though. All right. Now it's just... <laughs> oh, man. It's just if they can get to that uh, air defense in time before the uh, air defense takes out the healers. You should be able to one-shot and all this stuff. Now the healers actually might stay back enough just just so they don't get hit by that air defense. We'll see. Okay, so they break away. One peck is gone. And the infernal towers are actually going to burn through that healing. There's no hope for him. But maybe he might be able to get the rest of that money just in case. I've actually been thinking about doing this. Just doing a whole team of healers. Uh, but... I don't know. When you have the Inferno Towers like that, especially on multi, they'll get you. And his healers almost get taken down. They still manage to survive, and dang, it looks like the Inferno Towers burnt out. There's no more juice left. So these guys are just gonna walk around and clean it up. And that's the last of the healer. But they've done pretty much enough damage on the base to call it a good game. Alright you guys, so that's the last game. Be sure to subscribe for more of this stuff and I'll see you next time. Godson out.